I always find it interesting um, watching movies, TV shows, or reading books and um, and finding out, well, not finding out, and listening to what different people's thoughts and views as to how the as to what the future is going to be um and apple seed does just that hey guys what's up what's happening it's the king of games 98 and a few minutes ago i just finished watching for the first time the uh cult classic anime movie apple seed um so if you've never seen apple seed and are kind of curious about it and you know Maybe if you've never watched it and are curious about watching it and don't know what it's about. This is essentially how I would sum it up without spoiling anything. So, Appleseed takes place in a post-apocalyptic, like, future. Um, where the city's destroyed and humans and robots pretty much are fighting each other so kind of sort of like terminator but not really terminator and um the main character which is this girl dunan um she gets taken to this new uh city called um called Olympus, and in Olympus, uh, humans and what they call biovoids live together in peace and harmony, so basically humans and robots live together, and um, that's all well and good, but not everyone feels the same way, of course, you know, didn't see that coming, and some people feel like that they shouldn't live with biovoids, and biovoids, some biovoids feel that about humans. And so they learn about um, uh, this scientist's um, research on the bioroids and find out that it's called apple seed. And so basically, they have to get that data of apple seed. Ap they have to get apple seed's data in order to save. A character and the rest of the bioroid uh, existence from getting wiped out from these uh, evildoers that don't feel like humans or robots should coexist with each other. That's basically how I would sum up Appleseed, the anime movie. Okay, so now for the remainder of this review, I'm gonna get. In, I'm gonna talk about my thoughts, feelings, opinions about this anime movie, and then we're gonna wrap up this five-minute review. Okay, so um, first off, right off the bat, I just want to make it known, I watched this English dubbed, and I thought the English dub was actually really good, even though this movie is from 2004, yep, uh, 2004, I thought the English dub was really good, um, let's see. I thought the English dub was good. I enjoyed the story. It was quite unique. Um, the music was okay. It was kind of a bit odd. Um, now, a couple things I didn't like. I, okay. I liked the animation, but then I didn't like the animation. I liked the animation because it was in 3D, and for an anime movie, that was really different, because most freaking animes in general are only in 2D along with anime movies. This anime movie, however, was in 3D, which I thought was in 3D. Now, when I say 3D, I mean three-dimensional, not 3D, you know, put on glasses and it pops out at you. No, 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 no. I mean three-dimensional. So I liked it because it was 3D, but then I didn't like that it was in 3D because to me, the animation looked like I was playing a PlayStation 2 era video game. Okay. 
okay? Um, I know they tried really, really hard with that animation to make it look as damn good as possible, even for that era. And, you know, hats off to them. I got to give them props. It, it still is really good, but I, I just... I, I felt like I was playing a PlayStation 2 game the whole damn time. I'm, I'm sorry, but I really did try to like it. So I didn't like the animation, and I also didn't like that the story was kind of all over the place. And what I mean by that is, a couple minutes they would be here. Then it's like, oh, now it's uh, here. And then, oh, now we're going to do a flashback. So essentially, if you got up to P, you would be lost in like you know, when you came back. So without further ado, my final rate for the Appleseed movie is going to be an 8 out of 10. Thanks for watching, guys, and see you next time.